Hello, Mr. Barton here, and welcome to a video all about our Diagnostic Questions Revision Streams. Now, if you haven't heard or used the Diagnostic Questions Revision Stream before, flipping heck, you are in for an absolute treat. And if you have used them before, this year they are bigger and better than ever before, because we are catering for Key Stage 1 Primary, Key Stage 2 Primary, GCSE, no matter what board you're sitting, and even the IB. So I guess the first question to ask is, what is a revision stream? Well, this is based on the very valid assumption, I reckon, that the key to success at mathematics is continual daily practice. So what we do, whether it be 100 days before your exam or 50 days before your exam, we send your students two questions a day every single day. Now, they can answer these on our mobile phone app. They can answer them just on their phones, tablets, laptops, wherever they like. And every single day, you'll be sent key insights into how well your class is performing so you can intervene as appropriate. All this is completely free and you can set it up with the click of a couple of buttons as I'm going to show you now. Okay, so get yourself along to diagnosticquestions.com and click sign in and you'll be taken to the sign in page. Now again, I'm a little bit Potter obsessed so I'm going to log in as Dumbledore. And once you sign in, you are taken to your dashboard. Now this will show you all the classes that you are assigned to. And that's an important point because you can only set uh, streams up for classes that you're assigned to, just like you can only set quizzes for classes that you're assigned to. Uh, but this is fine because what I want to do is set one for Ravenclaw. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go to useful actions and I'm going to scroll down and I'm going to see there assign a stream. So give that a click and that'll take you to our streams page. This, and this gives you a nice little bit of information about them. And as I say, ideal exam preparation. And here are all the different streams. So we've got White Rose Maths Hub. I've got involved and created as a key, uh, key stage one SATs and key stage two SATs. We've then got AQA, Edexcel and OCR higher and foundation streams, we've got IB Math Studies and IB Standard, and we've even got WJEC Welsh Numeracy GCSE. So let's say uh, Mr Dumbledore wants to assign Edexcel GCSE Foundation. All you do is you click Assign to Students, and you get taken to the Assign page. There it is, Edexcel GCSE Foundation, and all Dumbledore needs to do is pick his class. So let's say it's Ravenclaw, and it'll just say there's the start date, 100 quizzes, click Assign and you're good to go. That's all you need to do. Now, a couple, uh, you get a little confirmation that success, your stream has been assigned. Now, a couple of things uh, just need to state in here. If I just go back to the streams page, you may be saying to yourself, uh, wait a minute, this is bad news because I'm watching this video way before the 14th. Do I have to wait to the 14th? Not at all. You assign this as soon as you like. And Possibly even more importantly, you may be watching this video after the 14th and thinking to yourself, oh no, I've missed out on the streams. Not at all. Just click assign to the stream, uh, assign to students, just as I've done there, and you will pick it up um, wherever it is in the stream. So if there's 70 days to go, your kids will receive 70 days. If there's 80 days to go, they'll receive 80 days and so on. So um, the sooner the better, sign up to these streams, but it's never too late, if that makes sense. So then your students will automatically, from the day the streams start, receive two questions a day. And you just need to remind them to log in. And as I say, it will be far better for them, um, I think, if they download the app, because then they can learn on the move. And a little bit of advice from streams in the last few years that I've run with my kids, it's getting them into a regular routine. And some students, uh, some of my year 11s last year, um, found that they liked to do it just before they went to sleep at night. Some uh, liked to do it just before they had their tea. Some did it on the bus in the morning. Some did it when they were sat in detention with me because they hadn't flipping remembered to do it. But the key is saying to your students, find a time every single day when you're going to do these two questions. Because these questions have been chosen by uh, and written by exam boards or authorities such as the White Rose Maths Hub. These are ideal preparation for your students. So I wouldn't want your students missing out on these particular things. And the only other thing to say is where do you get results to these streams? Well, you get these just, just like you would anywhere else. So um, if I want to see the results of my Ravenclaw stream that I've set up, if you just click on assignments, then you'll get uh, normally here, below here is where you'll get all your assignments that have been set. And on top, you'll get the stream. And that's where it's going to show all the results. And all you need to do is click on Insights. And every single day, that will show you how your kids have got on. It will be ordered in terms of the most recent question. You'll be able to see problem areas. You'll be able to see students that are struggling and all that kind of stuff. And hopefully, it's going to really help you intervene. 
Anyway, I hope that makes sense. And um, to obviously get these streams up and running, you need your classes on diagnostic questions. And probably the easiest way to do this, if you just click this little chat window down here, you can actually just uh, start a new conversation and you can send us um, a spreadsheet just by clicking that little paperclip button that's got your students on there. First name, surname, the class code um, for the, the class name that you want them to have and so on. And we can create classes for you. But get that done as soon as possible because we've got loads of schools wanting to get involved with this. So we're, we're trying to keep up as, as best we can. So we'll upload your classes for you. You assign them the stream and then sit back and let hopefully the revision take care of itself. Anyway, I really hope you and your students find the streams useful. Take care and good luck with the revision.